a really beautiful topic of effortlessness. And uh, I see for myself the introduction to open intelligence and the invitation to simply relax, which is basically what we're invited to do with the Balance You training. Relax as you are. Make no effort to to change this current moment, the appearance of the data streams, the thoughts, emotions and sensations and to recognize open intelligence, all-encompassing intelligence, bright intelligence, already present, <coughs> right here. And this um, effortless way of being that's already the case, that requires nothing to bring it about, takes some getting used to. <laughs> After um, years, not just in my life, but collectively, I mean, how many, like a millennia, of thinking that we, we really need to effort to simply be okay, to have the right combination of life circumstances, thoughts, emotions, and sensations. The data streams need to all be in place and be correct according to whatever um, belief systems we have value systems and uh, and so then being introduced to open intelligence and we can introduce ourselves right now just by stopping thinking for a moment and noticing what remains and we see there's an openness brightness clarity cognizance open intelligence and the thoughts come back in sensations everything just flowing naturally with no effort open intelligence with no effort, present. And until being introduced, I'd just not known, just overlooked. And now we recognize. We can all recognize, and in short moments we can simply return to that recognition. The simple practice, simply to acknowledge open intelligence whenever you naturally remember to do so in a short moment short moment of allowing the current data stream just to be as it is. The most effortless way of being. And um, I see it's taken, I'd say my, from the introduction and then the last eight years is an ongoing relationship of trust <laughs> with open intelligence. Trust with the recognition and um, with basically a, a truth about reality, about my mind, about myself, my true identity that I wasn't introduced to. And then seeing, you know, as a constantly thinking, not constantly, but over the years, different data streams coming up, whatever they may be. Stress. <laughs> Just trying to see what I is. <laughs> Stress. <laughs> and, um, I mean, like, come on, that's like the big red flag, right? <laughs> I mean, societally, we're all telling ourselves and each other, like, you know, don't feel stressed, it's bad, stress, this word, write, write stress on space, stress. You know, if that comes up and these are the symptoms of stress, this is what you're meant to do about these symptoms when you get them. Um, you know, it's like activating all sort of action stations, you know, like to, to basically eradicate it, to get rid of it. And... Um, and so it's brand new to be invited to simply rely on open intelligence when the stress arises. And we see the stress is inseparable from open intelligence. It's not found anywhere else apart from in our open intelligence. Inseparable like the breeze in the air, the stress is the dynamic energy of, of our intelligence. And the descriptions that go with it. <clears throat> You know, all of the data streams. And, and so the gift of a short moment right there is, is the true seeing. True seeing, true recognition of what's actually going on. It's like a revelation. <laughs> you know, you see this thing, this sort of big, I want to say boogeyman, <laughs> stress that can kind of come and get me, take me down. It's going to be like the end of everything. Oh my God, if I'm stressed, like that's it. I'm a failure. I'll never do anything properly ever again. You know, it kind of goes a bit extreme in thinking. Just a bit, when we just relax right there, 
and we show ourselves, we prove directly open intelligence is there, clear, bright, strong, stable, welcoming everything equally. And this stress is just great potency and, and really nothing to fear. And firstly, complete relaxation really prepares us so well for recognizing open intelligence and just allowing that data stream. We see the data stream self-release. The stress that I felt sitting in the chair, I could call it stress, I don't know, it's a bit of a sort of funny term now, but, um, you know, excitement, whatever I could label it as, nervousness, I don't know, hunger, <laughs> then it, just letting it be as it is and relying on already completely relaxed open intelligence. The stress arising completely relaxed, that sensation arising in my body completely relaxed, the, the descriptions effortlessly arising and resolving on their own. So we abide as the effortlessness of open intelligence, already the case. And um, seeing that the data streams, they self-release on their own. And that's where we really see what's going on. We just see at that moment, we see open intelligence shining. See the basis of everything, unaffected. So that's what's the most powerful. All of these stirrings of data streams that I had taken to be something that was so wrong and meaning that really something had to be done and then seeing open intelligence taking care of everything. I did nothing to remove that stress. It's just this part of this dynamic flow. cause for great celebration, <laughs> like uh, the, the mirage, the mirage of stress is just seen through, you know, there's actually nothing to hold on to or make solid, we, we, we can't hold on to it, even if we try really hard by telling ourselves again and again that we're so stressed, it will um, be gone like mist in the air, resolving. And then it starts to become just so exciting to be fully human. <laughs> like to feel everything fully, relying on the stable ground of open intelligence, knowing that nothing affects that. <laughs> nothing affects my innate stability, clarity, and everything is great power. And the opportunity to get to know it as greatly beneficial power. And that's what's so exciting. If it doesn't seem obvious now, it will. If you just continue on with short moments, that's what I see. Continuing on, relying on open intelligence. Continuing on with the Balance View training, the support, the empowerment network that provides everything to bring this about in our own experience. Effortlessly so, effortlessly so. <laughs> we can just, um, you know, showing up so the four mainstays are the four elements of support and empowerment of balanced view. And just simply showing up to them, short moments, taking them whenever I naturally remember to do so. And often the, the stressful data streams or the negative data streams were the, always my reminders right there. Relax, recognize open intelligence. And then we have trainings and media, endless resources to just support this recognition, bring it about in such a natural way, you know. Listening, listening, hearing, writing these teachings, hearing people speak about their experience of open intelligence just um, awakens it in us. It's uh, infectious. And then the trainer, is another mainstay, someone to share their experience with us, customize the support for us in our life. And then the community, hanging out with other people who are relaxing as they are, effortlessly. Again, it just, um, just more and more relaxation pervades everyday life. And it just feels, it's, amazing like how I just think to before I am um, I just always wanted to feel comfortable in myself I just wanted to feel like 
everything's okay, you know. I know I know what to do. I know how to be in this situation. Um, and that's what I see coming about through the recognition of open intelligence. And that just being the very start, that pervading into all areas of life where the stability of open intelligence is our ground and our platform. And then very naturally, I just, we can start to look at how we wish to contribute in the world. What are my unique strengths, gifts and talents and how do I want to use them? Really to be of great benefit to all. And that, um, and seeing before, before meeting the training, I was just so busy with just feeling okay. <laughs> Basically, that was just the goal. That was where the bar was set, like to feel okay, to be liked, to you know, just have a, a nice life, basically. And then you meet, meet the balance through training and that bar just gets sort of like <laughs> blown off into the cosmos somewhere and there is no bar. You're, there's no limit. There's no limit. And everybody with their unique contribution, their unique strengths and gifts, like everyone with so much to offer in an effortless way, that's the best thing. What do you love to do? <laughs> What do you love to do and how would you like to share that with the world? And, you know, when we stop busying ourselves with trying to fix ourselves, it just releases so much energy to be of benefit. And everything is available in the, in the Four Mainstays just to support anyone who would like that, however far they would like to take it. And, um, and if you're here for the first time, try out test out the short moments, see how that is just through your day, try something new and, um, and come back to open meetings, come back over a week, over this week, let it settle, even if it feels like you understand nothing, I totally understand, <laughs> agree, I understood nothing in the beginning but I just kept coming back because there was something in the recognition, I just, was so fascinating something about myself I hadn't identified before and I wanted to know more. <laughs>